Hello there! As you can tell, I'm an adult, not just a kid who wandered into the wrong store and purchased a blazer at first chance, but I am a full-fledged adult. And as an adult, I have so many more responsibilities to do, such as grocery shopping, something I never, ever wanted to do ever when I was in college, okay? I would do the meal plan nine times out of nine, okay? Don't know why they're only nine times, but there's nine times out of nine. But now that I'm in England, I've had to do a lot more grocery shopping, and I absolutely hate it, because the only time I can do it is when I get out of work, when everyone else is doing it. So I go to this tiny little Tesco, and it's just full of people bustling around like it's the London Underground, just being rude and grabbing loaves out of my hands and just running down the wrong aisles, and I'll say, it's quite an annoying experience. Especially now that I'm shopping for more than one person. My lovely flatmate Dodie. She's great and all, but you know, I like eating real food and she likes eating corn. So you can see the you know, upsetness I have here. However, when I first moved to England, there were so many big differences in grocery shopping that really just threw me a curveball. First of all, I'd end up going shopping. I'd get like pizzas and chips and french fries and burgers and hot dogs and a lot of ready meals and spaghetti bolognese. You know the drill, okay? I had no clue how to cook. Uh, nobody taught me how to cook throughout my life, so all I know how to cook is the stuff where the instructions are on the back of the package. If they're not there, I don't know what I'm doing. So I buy all this stuff, and I get to the end of the register, and I'm just waiting. You know, they're ringing it up. I'm sitting there like, when can I pay? When can I pay? And then it gets to the point, and she's like, put your card in. I put my card in, there's a huge queue of people just lined up behind us, and then everyone starts looking at me like I've got eight heads, which I don't, I just want you to know, I only have this one. And I look over, there's no bag boy! There's all my stuff, it's just sitting there, in the, just in the pit, and no one's putting it away! What? I, what? I, I don't know about you, I'm not 22, but also, I don't, I didn't know I had to do that, and how am I supposed to, by myself, pay for my stuff, and bag all my groceries, and there's a huge queue, I'm just getting stressed out, so I kind of just throw everything in, pizzas and eggs and bread, and just <laughs> get in the bags, and I, I carry them out after like five minutes of these people just kind of judging me, like, come on, we have other customers, and it stresses me out, because I know there's people waiting for me, and that's like the worst thing, so I get all this stuff, and then I realize, I've just bought all these groceries, how am I going to get them home? I don't have a car, because no one has a car in London unless they're friggin' Boris Johnson or Richie Rich. So I'm like, oh, okay, I've got to go walk across this giant metro highway and then down the road and up uh, the elevator, which, by the way, first time I did grocery shopping, elevator was broken. I'm up 11 floors. I walked the way, okay? I looked like Arnold Schwarzenegger after that. It was a nice workout. However... Because I knew I was coming back, I didn't want anybody to judge me for what I bought because if you didn't realize already, my diet was quite terrible. All these ready meals and things. So I had this strategy, which was all this terrible food, but on my way to the register, I would always pick up a bag of mixed vegetables. Why? Well, I'm hoping the cashier's ringing up all this stuff going, fat piece of poop. Fat, look at this. Oh, look, oh. It's got some mixed vegetables. So he's looking out for himself. You know, maybe I'm looking out for myself in a way. So I would always get this extra bag of peas or mixed vegetables or corn or anything and I would just throw it in the pile and I was hoping that, you know, that would somewhat make them think I was trying to be healthy. But it turns out that when I left my first flat, I went into the freezer and there were six bags of mixed vegetables just unopened. I would just buy them to look good and I never ate them. I don't... What do you throw them in boiling water? I don't know. I need to know how to cook at this point. Dodie's better than cooking at me. And she's like the half my age, okay? It's not, it's not fair. But those are my problems with grocery stores. I just get too stressed out. I don't like cues. And even then, most people use the self-checkout. I want someone to do it for me, okay? Very first problems here. First world problems. But that's just how I am. Anyway, thank you. I hope you've enjoyed this little rant. I just I hate grocery shopping. Other than that, I guess I'll see you guys next Sunday. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.